Well, yeah, we're, we're rolling. Um, well, welcome. It's not really 10 Carat Info, because I suppose you could call this our emergency broadcast. Yeah, it's a, a special broadcast from the bunker, um, I think is the way of phrasing it. You may or may not be aware that by 31st of this month, we're going to be losing a solid chunk of, well, the majority of our digital library, whether that's yeah. downloads, certainly all of our DVDs that we've produced to date, um, which is a massive shame. There's a blog post about the details of it and to show you what's actually available in an emergency fire sale to help us stay on track. Um, But we'll put some links up about that. We'll get to more of the details later on. But we thought you at least deserved a bit of filling in on what was was going on, really. Yeah, I suppose better start with a list of what is disappearing. Uh, This will be gone by the 31st of this month. That's the 31st of January 2018. We will no longer be able to sell Volume 1, Volume 2 and Volume 3 DVDs, the Discovering Tenkara DVDs. That's the physical disc and the yeah. download version. Um, the discs are already gone. Mm. Um, there are no more discs. There are remaining stocks with Chris Stewart at Tenkara Bum in the USA. So yep. if you're in the NTSC USA, format. Yep, so that, that's the USA DVD format. Um on top of that, the downloads of those products will disappear as well. And also several of the downloads that went with the first series of 10 Carry in Focus. There are three downloads that are affected. The first one is the Dr. Ishigaki on stream seminar. Yeah. That was a great piece of work where we had Dr. Ishigaki visitors in the UK and you got to watch an, en- an entire on-stream lesson with him. It's about 40 minutes long or something like that. Yeah, and there's also like a breakdown where we kind of go through and actually do almost like an analysis, a technical yeah. analysis of yeah. what he's actually doing. So you'll no longer be able to buy that by the end of this month. There's also um, your fantastic manipulations. Um, it's an on-stream lesson with Paul where he gives you a whirlwind tour of the Japanese manipulation techniques and how to apply them. So Mm. it's a really nice little piece of work there. Um, I don't know whether we'll get a chance to to reshoot that in a new format in the future, but it's not going to be any time soon. No, and it certainly won't be that original thing as well. So if you want to see Paul demonstrate manipulations on stream, that's a a great, again, about sort of 30 or 40 minute piece that's that's a download. And finally, the Masami um, on stream lesson with analysis by us, we visited Masami Sakikibara, also known as Tenkara no Oni, in 2015. Yeah. And there's a great on-stream lesson with him there. And unfortunately, that will have to disappear at the end of this month as well. So if you're even slightly interested in those products, um, you can check out, you can check out little samplers in episodes of season one of Tenkara in Focus. Yeah. Um, if you are interested then definitely you should download them now before the end of this month. Yeah, I think here's the thing. It's a great, one of the great pities about it is there's some little really historic moments that through the little world, the little universe that we've got within Tenkara and the Tenkara community, there's quite a few little milestones that we Mm. managed to capture on on film and they'll just disappear from availability, unfortunately, because of that. There is stuff that will improve your technique on there, give you a better time on stream, but is there's the stories and the interest. And I'm yeah. particularly gutted that the um, Shoichi Saito um, interviews and yeah. tyings and a lot of technical insights as well as the catch and release mm. development and the conservation program stuff, um, that's in volume three particularly yeah. of uh, Discovering Tenkara and the DVDs and the, the download. I suppose we ought to, you know, keep, we're keeping it to some kind of agenda or bullet points. Mm. We should tell people what's not affected. We should tell people what the future is, you know, after this. Well, and also maybe a little bit about what's caused all this. Yeah, I mean, a bit a big thing as well is that this has been prompted by we've been getting lots of questions. So mm. rather than forcing you to sit through a massive long text blog post, it's easy just to answer those questions yeah. directly to yeah. you um, video format. Let's get a few things out of the way right now. It, there is no problem with any relationships, copyright issues, or, or just general sort of... Um, Disputes yeah, or anything. Yeah. With anyone in Japan, anyone we've worked with in Japan, everyone we've worked with in Japan has been fantastic. In fact, none of any of the performers or any people that yeah, appear in front no, of camera. No one you see in front of camera has had any issues whatsoever, and they've all been more than happy to be a part of this. There are no disputes between me and Paul. I think there are a few people very whoa, worried. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> yeah, I think a few people were very worried John, that, I've been that, meaning to say. Yeah, uh, that we had a, a dispute between us and it was going to mean the end of Discover mm. Tenkara. Um, for all our fans out there, 
Um, we won't disappoint you. And sorry to all our enemies that would. Like hey, to don't see put us the fail. pressure on. We won't disappoint. You. Come on. <laughs> we're we're going to keep doing this. We're going to try and keep doing this. Um, in terms of things that are not affected, um, we will continue to produce Tenkara in focus as often as we can. But because we're going to lose these products, it does mean that we're under financial strain, and the cost of putting out a free program is a real cost that we bear. And it's subsidised largely by what we can sell. So the regularity of 10 carat in focus is likely to suffer because of that. Yeah, and it'll it's be just... a bit more patchy, but we'll do our best yeah. to kind of keep up service as, as, as well as we can. But we need to concentrate on creating new material yeah. um, we make premium you, download. Yeah, well, we'll make you this promise, and that is that we're going to work our asses off this year to bring mm. you new material. Now, a lot of that is going to have to be paid material because we have to replace the products we're losing. Mm. And currently, we have sort of, you know, spent this last month or so going over our finances. We are at operating at a loss as of now, and mm. we need to turn that around. So we need to focus on some paid media and streamlining what, what we sell. Yeah, we're passionate about sharing the stuff that we've learned, but not to the point where we end up on the street, um, yeah. is essentially. Yeah. Yeah. And with the things like the email lessons and with Tinker and Focus itself, um, we love doing it. We would do it completely for free if we could, but essentially it acts as a, an outright bribe because we know that enough people that, that receive our free media and enjoy it go on to then become customers. Yeah. So hopefully it's a win-win relationship, but that's yeah. how we're able to do it. Yeah. Um, we don't have any backers. We don't have financial um, investors or, or yeah, that kind yeah. of thing. In terms of things that are not affected, uh, the Karasu rods are a complete separate entity from the media, so they yeah. will not be affected. The Karasu rods are safe. There will be spares and backups and replacement parts, etc. Mm. There will be a steady supply. In fact, um, it is one of the success stories. There is going to be an Amazon store in Japan opened up by a, a friend of ours in Japan. So Karasu's are now going to be on sale to the Japanese. The, the demand has been uh, there. Sold a few already yeah. <laughs> without them being available officially. So Yeah, kind of... so the, the demand is there for Karasu's in Japan. They are being sort of lauded as the best the best 360 ever made. So the, that's a, a little bit of a success story, a bit of yeah. good news to come from yeah, Discover absolutely. 10 Carat. Same thing again, the print book and the Kibari e-book um, aren't affected yeah. uh, by any of this. Uh, running down the list is also the Takahashi-san... That master's yeah, sort of nymphing demo online. I, I think that's playing and bound <laughs> now is, where yeah. we were looking for something that we weren't <laughs> going to lose to leave playing in the background. So, yeah, the, the Takahashi-san, that's a fantastic download. It features... Uh, well, what? Shin Takahashi is an amazing regular um, Tenkara angler, but that, that particular video is a fusion of competition nymph-style fishing and um, Tenkara-style techniques mm. melded together. And in stream with him, translating and giving commentary while he's translating and, and sort of walking along in, in the stream at the side of Takahashi-san is Uberto Caligaric, mm. who is a gold medal Italian competition angler. Mm. Um, speaks excellent Japanese, excellent English, and of course, excellent Italian. <laughs> <laughs> um, so he gives you the full English sort of rundown of what's going on in stream as it happens. So that's, mm. a, that's a great download. He's on his shoulder as he's fishing, which is good. Cool. We also have a couple of other on-stream lessons from Japan, one with Go Ishii and one with Kazuo Kurahashi, known mm. to his friends as Kurasan. Um, there's another couple of great downloads that have got a little bit of commentary from us in places as well, I think, and a few few sort of freeze frame elements in there. Yeah, um, but basically those that we just listed, those are not affected, so they'll still be available beyond the end of this month. Um, and because of that, they won't have the special offer um, mm. price. Att We're basically running a fire sale so that we can bankroll some of the stuff we yeah. need to do to get yeah. back on an even keel. So on that subject, we'll, we'll come back to it again, but just before you know, we miss and skip over the point, uh, if you go to the links that are either below this, depending on where you're watching it, or on screen if it's on YouTube for you, um, we've got uh, a, a special code called Kibosh <laughs> in lowercase, um, and we'll, we'll put that out for you as well um, so that you've got the proper text that you can use. That'll take 10% off uh, the price of any of the discounted products right up until they disappear from the market at midnight on January 31st. Yeah. So go ahead and take advantage of that. We know you'll you know, really enjoy the content if you liked anything that we've done before, and we'll really appreciate it because it'll help us to carry on doing what we want to do. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's you know, for you guys out there, it, 
it is a win-win if you buy these things. You'll save money. You will get them before they disappear completely. And it would be a shame to miss out. If you're a 10 carat enthusiast, they are little pieces of history and it would be a shame to miss out. But mm. on top of that, you're actually helping us to keep this going. Every every purchase that's ever been before, we always take the time to thank people for supporting us. But right now, we need that support most of all. We we've been dealt a bit of a, a you know a, a bit of a harsh blow with what's yeah, happened, yeah, yeah. which I suppose brings us around to uh, trying to explain <laughs> well, to people actually, the, yeah, the people <laughs> the yeah, juicy details w- without sort of uh, you know inviting legal action. <laughs> well, no, just not going too into it. But yeah, yeah. Um, essentially, in Discover Ten Carat. Those me and Paul, we are the guys that are passionate, but we were also involved with a third man who shall remain nameless, who was a camera operator and video editor, and he edited the DVDs and webmaster as well. Yeah, awesome. yeah, uh, he was in charge of the website, set up the website, managed the website. Um, over the past couple of years. His interest in Discover Tenkara has seemed to wane a little bit. Yeah, and being absolutely objective as well, you know, his other business to do with the videography that he did outside of our project was clearly his priority. Yeah. yeah. Which is a thing, that's fine, yeah. but it doesn't leave any room for us to then have a three way split on things yeah. when. One party's doing 10% yeah. of the work and taking a third of the business. Yeah, we actually got a figure on the number of days work that I've been putting in the past five years that Discover 10 Car has been running as a project. And he calculated that he'd done just under 44 days in five years. So mm. it's a very minor part in terms of the amount of work. We, we estimated that we'd done, um, as at the very, very conservative end of an estimate, we estimate we've done at least 500 days each. Mm-hmm for the actual video projects that's not it on, on, yeah we got included. up to that before even trying to drill down into everything else that yeah goes on as well, yeah so his part was minor but it was still significant enough that he was able to hold us you know hold us <laughs> well, to yeah. ransom basically well, yeah. over the footage um I, I, it's arguable you know whether that's the right sort of term but basically he decided he didn't want to be part of the project anymore and he wanted a large divorce payment, more than I earn in a year, and that's a fact. Uh, he, more, more than my previous year's income, he asked for as a ransom payment. Uh, sorry, a divorce payment. <laughs> <laughs> slip of the tongue there. Uh, Freudian slip, let's call that. Um, yeah, it was, a, it was a tough thing because it was basically pay me that or stop selling the footage. And we couldn't afford to pay it. Well, there's that, and also that we... Offered so well, look, we can, myself and John can continue on to produce uh, material uh, and continue to pay you your third on stuff that you've already worked on. Yeah, and that was seen not to be an acceptable solution. Yeah, um, the the simple fact is, is if uh, the third man had said, "Yeah, you guys carry on selling the products, people can carry on enjoying the products," and we offered to carry on sending him a third of the money, um, he flatly refused that. Mm. So that was an option. But he declined, and his basic the, argument was he did not want us to benefit from any of his work yeah. uh, in the future. That that was his his basic sort of requirement. Yeah, and um, I mean, we're, clearly, uh, we're representing our side of the story. Yeah. So you know, we're doing it as objectively as we can. But that's the situation yeah. we find ourselves in, yeah. for whatever reason, yeah. for whatever motivation. We can't put words in other people's mouth. But yeah. basically, that was what was offered. And turned down. So that's it's that's up to anybody to make their mind up on that. Yeah. So the, there's no point dwelling on that anymore. The simple fact is, is we were uh, involved with someone who was behind the camera doing some of the video work for us. And the you know on on most products, it's between a sort of third and a half in some products. Yeah. Or only a small percentage in other products. But the fact is, is his demand was that we either pay him the large divorce style payment Mm. or we stopped using any media that featured footage where he'd been behind the camera so all the media listed so far is basically not for sale never to be used again people have asked if we can put it out in Mm. the public domain for free no because basically he doesn't want us to benefit in any way from the exposure of that footage so there's a clause in what we kind of eventually settled on which is that it can't be repurposed for any other uh, use 
uh, anything that contains yeah. that footage. So that's that's the story. You know, we sorry if you know if you expected any more detail than that or any salacious gossip. Sorry to disappoint. <laughs> We have tried to remain as ob- objective as we can, but basically it, it does feel like a huge betrayal and it, it's difficult to remain objective. It's difficult when you turn something that's your passion into something that has yeah. to make its own, yeah. you know, pay its own way to be able yeah. to spend the time and effort that we do on the stuff. Yeah. Um, in terms of where that leaves us, we are in a difficult financial situation in, in losing probably more than half of our paid media um that has been a, you know a, a monthly income for us to well, enable us to the do bundle, it's a lot yeah, more than half yeah. to be fair so yeah thanks for depressing <laughs> me even more um but we this is the point we're not forget any of that other stuff that's gone on and the stuff that is going you know you've still got a window opportunity to get all that yeah. we did run you've unfortunately there was one that closed on the 15th of january with a 20 percent discount yeah. on the volume three Partly because we never got a chance to run a proper launch for that when it was first released. Uh, and also because it featured a lot of, sh- of uh, Saito San's stuff, which mm. was especially insightful. That's still available until the 31st with a 10% discount. So you can go ahead and, and still get that. But really, what we want to emphasize is, is that we're using this and we're using this fire sale um, effort to actually redouble our efforts and to excel ourselves and to go beyond it and be super positive. Essentially, we want to insulate you regardless of anything that we've got to face in terms of business, but we don't want you and the rest of the Takara community to lose out. So we're going to do our level best to produce our best work in future. So we still think the best stuff that we've got to do is in front of us. It's certainly not behind yeah. us. So that's the main sort of take home I would, yeah. I would put into the yeah. the broadcast. I think we ought to probably wrap it up at that and just sort of say... Um, Obviously, again, reiterate massive thanks to everyone yeah. who has continued to support us throughout this. Yeah, that goes for people that buy our media and for people that have been in our media and for people that have just helped us. People that help share them. it, people yeah, that yeah, give people good who, yeah, comments on yeah, things. Yeah. Um, you guys have been the lifeblood. We're sorry that this has had to happen. We tried our, our you know, our. Our best. We were as reasonable as we could be, but yeah. we just couldn't afford to give away basically what is a year's wages for me. Um, yeah, and we're trying to ride it out over the Christmas period as well. And obviously we're putting yeah. out material that hopefully you guys enjoyed um, during that time as well. And sort of, you know, it might always seem like sort of ducks on the surface, but often we are paddling like crazy yeah. underneath. So yeah. um, <laughs> you, you may notice we're sat, in, we're sat in my studio. We've not lost the studio facility. We've not lost camera equipment or anything like that we've just lost someone that used to do uh, a part of of the camera work for us and i've now secured ownership of the domain names as well so the website yeah. was under threat as well yeah. which is um, we've avoided that now yeah that's um, now safe so discover tenkara although financially we are in a tight spot we've not lost any of the capacity. capability to do <laughs> to do what we do so we're going to be working hard in 2018 to keep bringing you the the sort of 10 car media that you've been used to and we hope that we can replace that paid media as yeah. quickly as possible and bring we're gonna, back we're going to work on that yeah so go ahead use kai bosch we'll spell it for you so you, that you don't make any slip ups it is lowercase um that'll give you 10 percent off until these things disappear forever so there's no <laughs> there's no sort of fear of the um uh, the discount code going out of use before the product basically <laughs> when you can't use the discount code anymore yeah. it's because the product's not there anymore yeah. um so go ahead and use that check out the blog post that gives you the instructions and the links through to actually buy those things from our government road platform uh, to get a hold of the downloads if you still want a physical one try and bother chris stewart at tinkarabum um, and get those before they sell out because we won't be able to resupply him with any more mm-hmm. beyond this batch so huge thanks again uh, we'll sign off at that and uh, we hope that we can continue doing this for as long as we're, we're able to we'll catch you next time yeah with cheery news yeah. <laughs>